Well, here we are on Thursday the 9th of August, and it's day uh, 11, I think, uh, with the harvest. We're right up on the top of the hill now. You know, if you look down there, it's that sort of looking south towards Cheltenham, and a uh, little way that way is Chigsbury again. Uh, it's a field called Sheldon's, it's 20 hectares, and it's a variety called Camelot oil seed rape. Um, and uh, it's the first time we've grown this variety. We uh, are looking at it with a bit of a trial to see how it performs, how it grows against uh, DK Cabernet, which is what it could potentially be replacing. Uh, this field was uh, desiccated um, about three weeks ago, so it's very, very, uh, very, very ripe and fit and ready. Uh, desperately keen to try and get it all harvested before we have any thunderstorms up here. Um, which will be uh, very, very helpful. There's the yield monitor uh, just up there. Obviously heavy thunderstorms on crops that are just uh, ready for combining can result in a lot of the pods shattering with the, with the weight of either heavy rain or even worse hailstorms. So there's a bit of pressure on. We've got about 90 hectares left. Weather forecast is good for about three days. So I'm hoping that we, without any sort of mechanical issues, um, we ought to be able to get through that. So um, we've got a reasonable yield going along there at the moment, sort of four and a half tonnes, moisture of seven. It's come down very, very quickly. Um, and I've been playing around on this uh, mapping system with some of the flags that you can do in here. So if we just have a flick in the Green Star 3, I've got some flags set up here. One there for cleavers and black grass and wild oats. So if we come across a little patch of, uh, in this case, cleavers in this field, there are a couple of little areas. Um, you could just press a button and um, there's the map. That's where we are. Oh, grain tank is three quarters full. So we've got, uh, got a trailer just waiting over there. So I'll drive down there and hopefully unload coming back uphill. Um, there's the map, that's where we are, and those little orange patches are where the cleavers are. So that information can go back to the office um, and we'll put that on the, uh, on the field map. So when we're crop walking, when it's wheat next year, we'll be able to uh, have a much better idea as to where the, where the populations of weeds are. So um, things will be going along quite nicely. Reasonably, reasonably thick canopy. Um, yeah, quite happy with this at the moment. Loads and loads of dust, which is a good sign. It's having to stop to clean the windows of the combine every couple of hectares because I can't see the trailer, can't see what's going on. Um, so fingers crossed the weather holds with us and uh, catch up a bit later on to see how we're progressing.